Hey, what's up guys, it is Thanksman, and welcome back to another episode of Fashion Friday. Sorry this is a little bit later on Friday night, but I've been pretty busy with the DLC the past couple of days. Anyway, this series, if you're not familiar, is basically where I go through some pretty cool outfits and show you guys how to make your character look the best possible that he can be. Or she can be. And I do these every Friday, obviously, that's why it's called Fashion Friday, so if you aren't subscribed, make sure you do that so you don't miss out on future episodes. Now, if you want to leave a suggestion for next week's episode, let me know in the comment section. I'm actually looking for some cool flight-related ones. I have one in this video, but let me know in the comments if you can come up with some other cool ones. Even if you can do the glitch that I posted a couple hours ago where you can just wear the regular flight school helmet with some really cool clothes. If anybody can come up with an outfit for that, that would be awesome. But anyway, getting into the first one, we have the Alaska State Trooper. And this one is actually pretty specific. And it actually looks pretty much like an Alaskan State Trooper. If you actually Google it, this is pretty darn close. And to start it all off, we're going to go with the blue tuck shirt. Then we're going to put a navy tie on top of that. Now the standard armor you're going to see at the end, it's optional. You can decide on whether or not you like it. For the pants, we're going to go with slate stripe sweatpants. All black Chelsea boots, and then for the head, a navy fedora and smoke cop frames. And this one is a great outfit if you are going, you know, for a police or whatever, you know, a good guy type of theme, and you want to be a little bit different. Like I said, this is pretty identical to an Alaskan state trooper, which is kind of odd, but it is another form of a police outfit. And I know a lot of you guys always love the police and the military outfits and want to see more. Like I said here, you can, you know, decide if you want the body armor on or not. You know, it depends on, you know, your preference. I decided just to leave it on just to give you that extra feel. I mean, it doesn't really do anything, but I figured why not add it. But uh, overall, this is a nice outfit again if you are trying to be a police officer or you want to role play as a cop or something like that. Moving on into our next outfit, this one is the Duster Pilot. And this one, as you can tell from the title, has to do with the new flight school stuff. Now, unfortunately, we didn't get a lot of stuff in the update, but we're going to make do with what we have. And from top to bottom, we're going to go ahead and put the Pikey's t-shirt on. And then we're going to go ahead and put the brown leather jacket on top of that. For pants, go with tan work pants. And then for boots, the brown Chelsea ones. Now for head, um, obviously, you're going to want to put the flight cap on. And steel aviators, doesn't really matter which one. Any aviators really look good on that with this outfit. And then just to go with the old retro theme, or the old retro look to this outfit, um, I decided to add the auto and patch mustache. And especially if you do drive the uh, the duster, I think it's called, in the game of the crop duster, it's actually pretty funny, and it goes well with that plane, but it, you know, it goes well with any plane. Like I said at the beginning, you know, unfortunately, we didn't get that much stuff, so let me know in the comments if you come up with some other cool outfits, you know, using the limited clothing <laughs> options that we got with the flight school. But, uh, but overall, this is I, I think it's a really nice outfit, especially, like I said, if you are going for that classic retro type of look with your character for, you know, flying planes. And then last but not least, we have the female outfit, and uh, this one is actually probably one of my favorites. This one is Black Widow, obviously from Marvel, from the Captain America movies and, you know, Avengers. And to start her outfit off, we're going to put the black crop biker jacket on, then underneath that, we're going to put a black bustier. For the bottom, black leggings with black folded high heel boots. And then for your hair, go ahead and put long bob chestnut hair on. And this looks pretty similar to Black Widow from the movies. And I really like this outfit. So definitely if you have a female outfit and you are a big fan of, you know, the comics and Marvel and the movies and stuff like that, this one's a nice outfit. And regardless if you're not, you know, it definitely looks pretty cool and pretty badass, I'm not going to lie. But that is it with this episode of Fashion Friday. Hope you guys enjoyed. Again, if you want to leave your suggestions in the comment section, that would be awesome. Anyway, go ahead and drop this video a like if you did enjoy it and like the outfits. Subscribe so you don't miss out on any other more awesome GTA content. Share this video with other friends so you know they can have some cool outfits as well. But as always, it's your boy Saints fan. I'm out. Peace.